see a ball come off the rim, go towards it. Oh my God, listen. Hit me, bro. It won't be stolen. Oh my God, man. Oh, you could fade. You a little cowboy. I boxed him out. Let's go. Oh. You straight. We loud, though. Cook, cook, cook. Nah, we ain't lose. Uh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh. Huh? Yeah. Watch your mouth. Oh no. It's supposed to be a moment. This supposed to be a moment. It's supposed to be a moment. What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it? Hey, make sure y'all like the video. And make sure you subscribe if you are new, man. Nobody will know. It's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. And I'm finna show y'all the top three big boy center builds. One that can rebound like a god, okay, and shoot, okay, big popper, you know, and uh, the 99 rebounding, the big boy blocks, you know, the real presence in the paint, what you really need. We even got an inside that is a galactic god, and we have another 7 1 that is a, you know, a big boy that can shoot, right? Not 7 1, 7 foot, but. I'm going to go over all the bills. Make sure y'all watch the full video so you understand the spectrum on why these are the top three. Now, look, in the stage, they do run it a little different. They run 6-9, but most of y'all watching this video, you're not stage players. You're probably rec or pro-am players, and this is going to help y'all. Even, even this could be meta in the stage and stuff because you're so big. You're going to horse them, but people are so scared of the ISO and everything and then like being that big it's kind of hard to guard uh the Steve Francis zigzag but most of y'all y'all are never going to play that right and um just trust man these are these are like top pro am top rec center builds and they can compete on any level especially park and all that Mr. 72 man y'all y'all let me know if y'all remember uh, Mr. 72 hey look you're going to want to be built Look, the weight, the wingspan, this is all so you get particular things, okay? So pay attention. You try to tweak it, you're not going to be able to get what I get, man, okay? A lot of y'all be trying to tweak stuff, you don't realize why I actually did what I did. And also, you can make these builds on current gen too. They're, they're more OP because you don't have to hit certain restrictions and tiers and stuff. So you can make the build more OP, right? Just use your brain. I'll help y'all out. Okay, now you seven foot, right? You got a 76 strength. That's pretty decent, man. Uh, your acceleration does not matter. That is for speed boosting. Your speed, 72. You know, the plus four, you're gonna have a 76. That's pretty good, man. Most big uh, builds, they, they have that, right? And you're seven foot and you have that. So most big builds that be guarding people, like the six eights and six nine, they have like the, you know, the 75, 70 speed and they, they decent. You got the 82 vert. That, that That's pretty good. It's going to help you out with the boards, your contest, etc. Okay? Okay, now here is the defense. Okay, the interior do look a little low. Okay, this is a specialized build. You're going to see why I made it the way I made it. It's not look low, but it's 73. But look, you got a 93 block. Okay, that's gold anchor. You decent, you can stop anyone. Plus, being a 7 foot, you can stop anyone. Okay, I am going to show you a Hall of Fame anchor. Um, and you're just a demigod, but yeah, um, the perimeter and steel, like a lot of people probably gonna be like, bro, you can knock those down. You're not hitting anything with those, but look at seven foot, bro, you're going to want to have your steel, something, your perimeter, something, you know, just to move around and to be able to get interceptions and steals and all that type of stuff, man. You, you, you want those attributes. You got the 99 offensive rebound. A very clutch attribute but that a lot of people aren't investing in bro 
Everyone's missing this year. Everyone, bro. You got that 99 offensive rebound. You are a problem. And you're going to be a popper with that? Come on, dog. The pick and pop and then just, bro. Demi, 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 Demi stuff. You got the 84 defensive rebound. So, look, you got gold break starter, right? And you got nine, you know, got nine playmaking badges. You're going to have Clamp Breaker on that, huh? You know, some floor general bailout. You know, it's you know you, you can get some badges on this hoe. Um, I do have center builds with uh, unpluckable and all that, but look at everything you have to invest to get it. This is why current gen is better, bro. Um, for some reason with this game, y'all let me know if y'all notice this too. It's like if you don't have unpluckable unpluckable effects work better but if you have unpluckable on it works less <laughs> it's weird like you you would think you could run up to a center and just pluck them instantly every time but it, it don't be working like that right isn't that weird now current gen steals is just ridiculous so look 14 shooting badges now your plus fours you are going to want to put it on the shooting. You can get plus nine extra badges on current gen. Just look up how to do that. But um, on next, you plus four, you're going to want to put it on shooting so you can unlock the uh, catch and shoot and, and all that, man. So you got your agent threes bronze. It's going to help you with fading any type of uh, stop and pop the badge from last year. You got the claymore gold. You got the clutch shooter. You got, you know, you got a nice badges but that that catch and shoot gold you're gonna really want that hoe and you got a nice free throw and 66 mid range is good enough to green on so look yeah you see that finish and he a big boy now look you can spam them acrobat them acrobat layups them spinning layups them euro layups them them step through layups the uh all that stuff and you got you got you know you got nice post scoring so you can post niggas up you know, if you deep in the paint with little post hook cheese, you got that gold acrobat, man. Because of your layup, like, you know, you a problem. If, if you go for a dunk and it actually just does a layup, that hole is going to go in, okay? You got limitless takeoff on gold. You can get your contact dunks. You can fly from very far while being seven foot. You got silver posterizer, gold masher. You got Rise Up Silver and Fast Twitch Gold, man. Real big body stuff. You know, you got the standing dunk and all that. Real nice build. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Now, me personally at seven foot, I would actually hide that I um can shoot, right? A lot of people won't know that. And then you can just go out there spraying. They won't know that you can even get these takeovers. But it's up to you. You can apply these if you want and stuff, but me personally, I I, I wouldn't do that. Though. I would probably choose this. I don't know though. I'm not a center. I've not played center this year. I have dabbled in center and power forward builds in other years. By the way, this is a power forward build. I have done that in other years. And Demi God, you know, y'all looked at me in pro am. Even though no matter how any pro am video you see, I've scored the most points on the team in 99 percent of the time okay that's let you know how youtube can be you know moved around but it's all entertainment but these are the takeovers i would choose kevin McKell. voila you are inside out glass cleaner you see they ain't gonna know you can really bang like that you feel me okay right here chose these weights and wingspan for a reason you will see why Okay, so look, seven foot, you know, silver brick wall. Acceleration don't really matter, you know. You got the speed of a big guard build, so, you know, you can move around, guard ball, decks a little bit. You got a nice vertical to help with the contest, your rebounds. You got a decent stamina. You got decent strength. Now let's get to the good part. So, uh, yeah, okay. You got that 82 interior Hall of Fame workhorse. You know, you got the perimeter and the steel. Of course, you can knock those down, but you need those to be a big boy and um, be able to wiggle around and be able to use that glove and interceptor. It's going to be very vital, man. 
And look, you got a 99 block at seven foot. If you, anyone scores on you, you are trash. Okay, you are trash. You have to figure out the game. Game is, uh, but bro, if you're not getting consistent stops with this, I don't know what to tell you. On current gen, you get one block, you get takeover. It's crazy. Um, and you have a 99 offensive rebound. Very broken, especially at seven foot max wingspan. Demi center build. Now look at this. 13 playmaking badges. Hall of Fame break starter. Real leak out. Real pass guy. 86 pass accuracy. After you get that offensive rebound with your 99 offensive rebound max wingspan, you passing it back so fast. You've passed faster than you know. It look real nice. And eventually, um, throughout the seasons, if you know you got the extra badge, you know, you can add some more to uh playmaking and then get that Hall of Fame dimer. What it's crazy. You already have Hall of Fame floor. So it's like you boosting all your teammates' offense ability by four. And then, you know, it's it's really, it's, you could do some nice stuff with this hoe. Now look, the shooting, very disappointing. <laughs> but you got that 69 free throw. That's enough to green with. I normally don't recognize, recommend non-shooting builds, but some of y'all, y'all still want to be insides and stuff. And, you know, this is how I rock it. This is like a comp, pro-am wreck you know you can even do this in the game bro like you play park with this you're horsing everybody bro you got 99 offensive rebound 99 block like you're a problem bro like you you a big boy and here go that damn play playmaking man we got gold limitless takeoff silver posterizer gold fast twitch gold masher gold rise up 90 standing dunk 86 driving dunk contacts Flying through the air, quickie drops. Driving layup a little weak. You know, you just got to be more particular how you move. And you got the uh, close shot standing layup cheese. And the uh, post hook cheese. Very broken build, man. Now, for this build, I would do these takeovers. Because you already have that crazy paint intimidation. You are now going to want to be able to get these extra animations and super abilities. Um, you know, it says increases your ability to perform grab and swap swap blocks. So maybe you can fly through the air to pin better. Um, you just jump in, contesting is it'll really be a problem, man. Real, real big boy gameplay, man. Hey, any of y'all got an 80 plus one percent? Hit me up. Hot Rod, is that his real name? Is his real name Hot Rod? But look, you got a nice name, Diamond Finisher. Here's what we got so far. 80 stamina. You gonna be all right, bro. You a center. You gonna max out that vertical. It's gonna help you with your contest, your rebounding, etc. You gonna max out that strength, man. It's gonna uh, give you brick wall. You know, in case you don't wanna spot up, you know, be a, a popper with a 99 rebound. You feel me? Um, you gonna you can set screens, be a little foo foo boy, and you got a 77 speed. Okay. Now, with your gym rat, or if, when you do your drills, that's plus four, okay? 77 speed on a seven foot, man. It's crazy. Eight, that's a 90 strength. That's a uh, 88 vertical. That's, that's, that's kind of wild, my boy. Now, look, 84 offensive rebound, 99 rebound, ridiculous on a seven footer. Hey, 93 block, you're gonna have gold anchor. And you're gonna have steel. And you know your, your interior is good enough. If you can't get a stop in the paint, e even though the paint defense is terrible, you can't get a stop being seven foot, gold anchor, 7'10 wingspan, 93 block with a 73 interior. Issue, bro. It's it's not the game. You you gotta put yourself in the right positions. I know sometimes it's gonna be the game, but if you can't, you know, if it if you you don't notice a difference compared to the the six nines, you know, on all of them, like them centers, it's 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 more than like you, you bro. So you gonna have Hall of Fame Pogo, Hall of Fame Chase Down, okay, Hall of Fame Box Out Beast, Interceptor, Glove, Challenger, Off Ball Pest, Gold Workhorse, you know, 
It's cold. 76 it's pass cold. accuracy. Gold break star. You know, you don't want a center with 25 pass accuracy, bro. I be playing random wreck. Y'all gotta come out to my streams, bro. I be playing random wreck, and the centers be having 25 pass accuracy. I be like, hey, bitch, why the fuck are you making a build with 25 pass accuracy? You're a PG. I shouldn't even have to pass the ball, blah, blah, blah. Like, bro. And I be trying to explain it to them, bro. They egos are bigger than stage players. It's crazy, bro. Guys, please. Do not make a build with low pass accuracy, bro. You make it too hard on your team, bro. Unless you're just going to stay in my career, that's the only reason. Guys, have a decent pass accuracy, bro. You make it too hard. Too many steals, bro. You can't. Come on, guys. Get it together, man. Please. Y'all wreck people are crazy. I don't know what's wrong with y'all. Y'all think y'all know everything. Boys be having a 21%, boy. 79 three points, 68 midi. Good enough to hit with. Free throw a little low, but you still can hit with this hoe. And, um, you know, you can't adjust some other things if, you know, you want to get the free throw up. So you got bronze agent threes, um, volume shooter, green machine, claymore, catch and shoot. Of course, you're going to have to add badges to the shooting. So you can get that uh, core, that uh, catch and shoot, because you're going to need that. And um, yeah. And by the way, you're going to have sharp take on this build, right? Crazy, right? 90 standing dunk. That's OD. Gold rise up. Quick drops. Okay. Now look, I don't know if I'm stupid. I don't think there's a height limit for quick drops. But if there is, I'm just dumb. Uh, but yeah, 80 for the quick drops. Y'all let me know in the comments. And we're gonna have an 80 close shot, bro. Okay, for the standing layups and stuff. So you're gonna have silver, limitless takeoff, back down punisher gold, hall of fame pro touch, silver bully, silver fast twitch, silver masher, and yeah, like this a this a nice popper spot up build. You see, you got the limitless ring, you could double up on that hole, but look, I wanna do this because if you have accelerator. On this build right y'all y'all make sure y'all put in the work to get accelerator so you can get it on all your new builds but make sure you get it before you make your new builds uh because then it transfers over but look i don't know if you have to do it on your first build or not y'all have to let me know bro 2k way too much stuff but on current gen you get one block you unlock double takeover so i'm assuming on next gen if you get one block in the paint bruh like a stop in the paint, you get like instant takeover. It's broken, bro. Um, with accelerator, it's broken as hell. So I don't know, bro. Um, you could choose whichever you want, or you could choose a glass one. Up to you, man. Just throw on limitless on this hoe. We got some bot ass niggas, and look, we are a. Y'all make sure y'all follow me on Twitch. The link is in the description. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.